There's a whole lot of science that goes into the business of heat treating, and Doug Peters knows a whole lot about that science. That's why his business, Peters Heat Treating, is one of the most respected in the heat treating industry. We take parts that are manufactured by local manufacturing companies, and we thermally process them to improve their physical properties. Meaning they alter the molecular structure to make that structure more dense, and that in turn strengthens the steel to industry standards. And so the more density you create in the microstructure, the longer the part lasts. For instance, if you have a plastic mold that makes bottle caps, we heat treat that mold so it lasts for millions of caps produced rather than tens of thousands of caps produced. They heat treat valves that go into nuclear reactors, components that go into airplanes, parts for transmissions, even parts for John Deere tractors are heat treated for maximum strength. When you're dealing with these industries and others, quality has to be front and center. You have parts that come in here that are going into bridges, cranes, um, airplanes. Um, it's my job to make sure that the processing is correct. Plain and simple lives are on the line. I mean, a lot of things we do, you know, if it's not done properly, you could put someone in danger. And workers are reminded of that every day. The motto here is, it's not who's right, it's what's right. Peters Heat Treating has three locations. This plant in McCain concentrates on aerospace, military, and nuclear work. They have two other Meadville locations as well. Keeping those jobs here means our economy benefits. You're providing jobs for your local people. You're providing a trade, which will provide for their families and their future generations. Made in America. Made right here. Made in America, Made Right Here is presented by Channel Lock and the Manufacturer and Business Association. To nominate a local business you'd like to see featured, click on the news tab at yourerie.com.